All right, it's time to open up an all new toy play set featuring Octonauts. We've got Inkling, Dashy, Turnip, Tweak, Peso, Quasi, or Quasi, sorry, uh, Barnacles, and Shellington. All right, I can't wait to open up and start playing. Let's explore, rescue, and protect with our Octonauts friends. Let's see if we can get inside here without using our grown-up scissors. Oops, kind of tearing the box a little bit. That's okay, though. We'll make sure that we put the box in the recycling. Here we go. All right, oh, we're so close, we're so close. Whoops, we definitely ripped the box that time. Man, they really taped this up good, didn't they? Okay, there we go. All right. I wish we hadn't ripped it so much. It does have this fun ocean background. We could use that as the background for our playset. I could probably still pull it out of there, but still use it. Okay, so let's see what what toys we have here. Ooh, I think I like. Uh, I think I'm gonna open up Inkling first. He's really cute. He's a little octopus. All right, so here's Inkling. And let's see, it looks like it's a pretty hard plastic figure. So you can't really move the tentacles that much. That's a little disappointing. But he's still really cute. There's a lot of detail on him. You can even see he has like these little spots on his noggin. He's got his cute little bow tie. That's a really cute toy. We're gonna put him down right over here. Okay, let's get let's get Dashy out next. Oh, there we go. Hope we didn't break anything. No, we didn't break anything. Oh, okay, so she does move around a little bit. This is exciting. She can move her arms up and down. She can kind of do this little jumping move right here. So she looks like a lot more fun to play with. We can actually move her around more than we can Inkling. I'm glad to see that. I'm glad that we can move some of these toys around. Okay, let's see who's next. Let's get him out. <laughs> oh, look at this. He can move his little legs too. Or wait, can he? Oh, they kind of just jump up, don't they? Boink! Boink! <laughs> That's fun. Can we move his arms? Oh yeah, we can move the arms! La, 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 la. <laughs> cool, can we twist this? It's a little flexible. We can kind of bend it, but it's not really twisty. So we'll put him down over here with our friends. Uh, let's get Tweak out next. Okay. Come on now, Tweak. Yay! Here's Tweak! Nice, pretty mint green color. Ooh, we can swivel the head. Can we, can we turn the head on, on Dashy? Hey, we can. Cool. Neat. And then we can uh, pull these arms up, lift these legs up, have them do some exercises. And one and two and one and two and one and two. <laughs> That's a lot of fun. Let's get Peso next. He's probably my favorite. I really like penguins. And just like the others, he can swivel his head around, and he can raise his arms, and I think he can swap his feet out. Yeah, he has his little flippers. He can put his feet out, so he's ready to go down the slide. Whee! <laughs> That's a lot of fun. Hey, let's see if we can make his head go all the way around backwards. Oh, you can't. You can only make it go this far. That's fine. Penguins' heads don't go all the way around. That's owls. Okay. Let's get barnacles out next. Come on. Barnacles. Ah. Whew, some of these are really tricky to get out. All right, but here is Barnacles, and he's the leader of the Octonauts. You can see he's got his nice little hat on up here. And he can raise his hands, he can shimmy his head, left and right. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And he can lift up his legs. All right, so there's Barnacles. Only two Octonauts left. Let's pop out Shellington. Come on, Shellington. All right, here's Shellington. Hooray! Oh, I like his cute little nose. He's got a cute hat, too. You can turn his head around. You can lift his arms up. Looks like we could even probably put some other toys in these little hands right here if we had, like, a, a peg or a rod to stick in there. Then he can jump up and down. That's really cute. All right, it's time to get out our last Octonaut. Come on out, Crosby. All right, here he is. He's a cat. And even though cats normally don't like water, he's a pretty tough cookie. <laughs> That's why he has an eye patch. <laughs> 
So he can turn his head left and right, lift his arms. He has this nice, pretty orange color. Kind of reminds me of Garfield. We can see he has a little tail on the back, too. That's neat. I wish it poked out more so you could actually like flex it and bend it and stuff, but that's neat. All right, so let's take a look at all of our Octonauts figures together. We got Quasi. Oh man, we got so many. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to hold them all. Shellington, uh, Barnacles, and Tweak, and Turnip, and Dashy. Oh man, this is a lot of Octonauts. Peso and Inkling. All right, here's all of our Octonauts characters. We've got all new musical toys from Smart Kids. Here we've got a xylophone and a harmonica playset, and a backpack full of all kinds of fun musical instruments. Let's open up this backpack first. I'm really excited to get in here and see what we have. I love that they come in this cool carrying case so we can take our toys over to our friends' houses and have musical jam sessions. These toys look like a lot of fun. They actually come from the number one bestseller in kids' percussion instruments on Amazon right now. And I think I can see why. There's all kinds of really cool toys in here. Let's see what we have. Let's go ahead and uh, dump them all out and play with them one by one. Man, this is a great way for us to learn about music and how, kinds of, how many kinds of cool instruments there are to play. Let's start with these. I like these. These are fun little shaker eggs. So we'll take them out of their plastic. We have a green one and a purple one. And you can hear, they make a, a nice kind of a, a rain noise when we shake them. <laughs> it kind of sounds like a rattlesnake. <laughs> I like these a lot. This is an instrument so simple, even I could play it. <laughs> Let's see what else we have. Oh man, this looks really neat. It's very colorful, it has these bells on it. I'm actually not as familiar with this kind of instrument. Let's open it up. Man, we can make all sorts of cool noises with this. I bet this would be really good for playing jingle bells with. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. <laughs> I love how colorful it is and all these different bells it has on it. Let's try spinning it and see what happens. Oh yeah, these are really fun. We can even mix and match them. All right, we can make all sorts of fun noises with these toys. Let's see what else we have here. Ooh, here we have a little cymbal stick. Let's see. They're pretty easy to open, which I really appreciate. A lot of times when we get new toys, we have to get a grown-up to help us out with scissors or something. Um, these are very easy for parents to open. I don't think anybody will have any problem getting into them. So you see, we have this brick with these little symbols in it, and when we shake it, it makes that fun rattling noise. It's a good match for our little egg shakers. Cool. That's not all. We still got a lot more. Oh boy, a kazoo! I love kazoos. These are one of my favorite instruments, because anybody can play them. They make a funny noise like this. <laughs> That's a lot of fun. All right, let's see what we have here. Oh, these are neat. These are like little uh, handheld, um, well, they're like little mini tambourines. We have a bigger tambourine that we're going to open up in a little bit here, but I want to open up these little blue ones first. Wow, these are really nice. Check them out, they've got these pretty blue handles, so you can put them on your fingers like this, and then you can shake them to make that fun noise. All right, that's really great. I love the noises that are coming out of these. They're very, very fun. A lot of different kinds of sounds and different musical instruments are in this pack. Ah, now these are maracas. I remember when I was a little kid, we would make maracas out of uh, squashes and gourds. That was a lot of fun. These are fun. They're very similar to the egg shakers, but you hold them with these little sticks, and you can rattle them. Isn't that neat? Wow, we have so many fun noisemakers here. Ooh, and these looks like a set of bells. Let's see here. So we'll just pull them out. 
Now, I'm not as familiar with how these work. Oh, you tap them together, I see. That's a pretty noise, I like that a lot. It's a good way to call your cat for dinner, isn't it? <laughs> Man, there is an absolute ton of toys in this pack. I'm amazed at how many toys were in here. This is really cool. Ooh, are these castanets? Oh man, these are really fun. So these are red and blue, and they look kind of like clamshells, right? But what you do with them is you hold them in your fingers and you go. This is used a lot in Spanish music, and I like them a lot. Really high quality toys. Man, we got so many of them in this pack, too. I am very impressed with this Smart Kids series. Let's open up this fun little dookie here. Now, I gotta admit, I'm not sure what the name for it is, but I have seen them before. You can make all sorts of fun noises with this. You can... Right? By rubbing it up on there, you can tink it with the mallet. Oh man, that's a lot of fun. I think you can even do stuff with rolling around inside. As long as you're having fun, there's not really a wrong way to play with these. <laughs> All right, I've been saving this for last. Oh man, this is really good. It's a hand tambourine. All right, here we go. So as you can see, it's a yellow ring with little symbols on it has a hole for your thumb. Your thumb can go in here so you can hold it and you can rattle it to make that fun rattling noise. But you can also beat on it like a drum. All right. But that's not all. Remember we also have a xylophone set. Man, there is no end to the fun toys from Smart Kids in this set. All right, let's see how we get into here. We got this fun yellow box we gotta open up. Here is our xylophone. Okay, let's take this out. Ooh, we already started to hit some of the keys. Sounding a lot of fun. Now we got a xylophone here, but we also got a harmonica. So let's take a look at that first. Let's see what this harmonica looks like. Now as I understand, these are actually professionally tuned instruments, so they actually uh, are supposed to sound really nice. Let's see what this harmonica sounds like, huh? Yeah, that sounds real nice. I like the harmonica. But I'm most excited to play with this xylophone. All right, so the way a xylophone works is he has these two little mallets right here, that were, or hammers, I believe they're called, and uh, we're gonna use them to tinkle on these little keys like this. And it's gonna make different noises as we go up and down, these different colored uh, keys. So here we have C, D, E, F, G, A, B, and C again. It gives us a full octave. Isn't that neat? I have to say, I really like that it includes the letters of the notes along the keys so that we can go ahead and start learning our musical scales. That's really great for helping teach kids instruments. I'm a little bit better with my right hand than with my left hand. But really, you're not supposed to play it like this. You're supposed to set it down in front of you. That's a really nice sounding instrument, isn't it? <laughs> 